Hi guys, Manos. Today I will show you how to texture a model. And I will also show you how to set up a model with the toolbox. So, this here is my latest model. It's nearly finished in a Techni. But you didn't see anything because the model is now prepared to get its own texture. I used a standard texture with a grid down here for the beginning, but now the model should get its own texture. Preparations you have to do is you have to move every part of the model. Up here you have the texture. It's currently loaded. And every of these funny little squares here represents a one a part of your model. And click down here through this all parts. To move this po these uh, parts, you have here the offset. As you see, if you move it, this box is moving also. So now you have to move all the parts to a free uh, place. If you already done this, you go on with the next step. You go to File. Export as texture map. Now you can save this file as a PNG image to somewhere where you find it again. I will just save it to the desktop. Save. And open it with my painting program. I use a Coral Photo Paint. You can use everything you want. Here we open it. Where is it? There. See, here are now all the parts we have. Before I start with uh, texturing, I will save it in the normal format and the proper name. So then I export it as a PNG file and I save it to the folder of MCP. We save it to a bin Minecraft skins. With a transparency as a background, so we have no background. Okay, in Techme now we can load the texture and select the file we just created, MCP, uh, not this one. Where's my MCP now? A little bit confused. Where's my MCP gun? Mod. Yes. MCP bin Minecraft skins. And we select the proper skin. And you see all parts are back where they belong. This model has many placeholders, so the wings and other stuff will be recreated in shapes. So, if you now color one part, let's say I will color the gun. In a dark gray.
and export it again. You will see here all my guns have changed the color. So you switch between the painting program and Techmi and you see immediately if you save the texture file what do you have uh, colored here in Techmi. So that's all about building up a model and texturing it. Now I will show how to export and create a model file in Java. So again you have to prepare the model, you have to set up all texture offsets, you have to set up all uh, parts and you have to filter all parts you didn't need. In my model I have much parts called shapes. These will replace by shapes in the final model. The wings or here this fellows. These will replace by shapes in the finished model. So you have to place all the parts here and you have to sort them below here. I sort them to the body. Then we have below here the tail parts. Here's the back antenna, the gear here, and the parts for the wings. Left and right wing. So, what we do next is exporting as Turbo Model Thingy. Again, I save it to the desktop and open it. For working with Java files, I use a Dreamweaver from Adobe, but you can use every program you want. Even you can use the Notepad from Word or Microsoft. So, this is exported a file from a Techni. You see all the parts here, the shapes, the rotor, and so on and so on. Now we go to the toolbox. And we open the plain file creator. All you have to do now is uh, first give it a name. In our case, and select the proper texture size you have used in Techni. Then you go to your exported file. Uh, the router is not to be used here deleting. So now you have to copy all parts from the body. Oh, the body goes to here. Cut and paste. Then we continue with the tail parts. Then all that belong to the left wing. Oh, not that. The left wing and finally the right wing. Oh, 
Oh, and uh, the joystick in the cockpit, which is basically jaw flap model. So, if you have copied all the stuff, you simply press create Java. You can look the, at the output here. And all you have to do now is save to file and select your folder from MCP, which is located in MCP, SRC, Minecraft, Net, Minecraft, SRC again, Source. Save. Now we go to the source folder, opening the modeling helper, and set our model's name inside here, and the skin also from our model. Let me save it, and go to the normal folder, say recompile, It will take a few seconds. So, after finishing this, we can use the start client. Can close the toolbox meanwhile. Placing the model, and here we go. Our model inside the game. You will notice there's much, much to do with shapes here. So, I hope you enjoyed it. It was helpful. Bye bye.